Hey everyone and Happy New Year! I'm going to be kicking off the first video of 2021 with a collection tour. I think the last time I did one of these was this time last year. So yeah, it's about time I updated it. I've already got all my horses down and sorted by their breed, so let's do this! Alright everyone, I'm going to start back here with my nab strappers. So the first horse here is Millie and she is a mare. And next to her is Kiki and she is also a mare. Moving on down to our Clydesdales, we have Belle the Clydesdale Foal and Fred my Gelding. He is much bigger than Belle. Coming down from them, we get to my Connemara Pony Mare Misty. Next to her is Dolly and she is my Curly Mare. Then we've got the Tennessee Walker Clan. The first one here is Luna and she is a mare. This is Governor and he's a colt. Then we've got Hunter, the big stallion. Angel, and I think she's the special mare. And the last one on the end is Pogo, and she is a yearling. Moving on down, we've got our Pintos. So this is Bubbles, my yearling. Then in the middle, we've got Pocahontas, and she is the special mare. And on the end, we've got Mojo, and he is the stallion that came with the Shalike Cafe. And to the right of those guys, we've got Tango, who is our Pintavian mare. And next to her is Dude, and he is my paint horse gelding. Right here we've got Glimmer and she is a Lipizzana mare. And next to her are the three gorgeous Frisians. The mare here is Cora and the two stallions are Cyclone and Topthorn. And finally here on the end is Jack, my little Welsh pony stallion. I love this guy, he's just so cute. Right, moving to one of the middle rows now. We've got on the end here my three Mustangs. This little foal here is called Moana. And then we've got Warrior and Orlando, the two stallions. I'm probably going to customise one of them at some point, but I haven't actually gotten round to it yet. Then over here we've got my Hanoverians. This little foal is called Seastar. She is really, really cute. Then we've got Havana, the mare. Flame, this guy in the middle, and he is a gelding. Firefly, and she is a mare. And finally here we have Buddy, and he is a gelding. All right, on to the next breed. And here we have my quarter horses. Right here is Spirit the Stallion, and Pumpkin, one of the foals. Katie the mare, true for the gelding, and Crystal, and she's another mare. And finally on the end we have another little foal, and this one is called Pie. Right next to those lovely horses we have the Trackners. This lovely grey mare here is called Elsa. This little foal here is called Olaf. And the big stallion is called Blaze. Up from them we have the Andalusians. The two stallions here are called Zeus and Poseidon. Then we've got these two grey mares here. This one is called Mystic, and this is Blossom. Then here we have little Scout the foal and finally on the end is Jojo and she is the last mare then we have our big tinker horses this guy is called Jupiter and he is a stallion then we've got Cloudy and he is a little foal we've got Boris another big stallion then on the end here we've got Katniss and Boomerang the two mares I absolutely love both of these girls and we have come to the end of the second row. Moving on forward then, we have our thoroughbreds, or English thoroughbreds, whichever you prefer to say. The first little foal here is Star. We've got the mare Venus here, followed by Victory, the stallion. And finally, we've got Sevi, and she is the last mare. Heading on this way, we have our one Rocky Mountain horse, Gucci, and she is a mare. We've got Storm and Tic Tac, our Holsteiner mare and foal. Followed by one of my personal favourites, Maui, and he is a Lusitano stallion. Next to him are our two biggest horses, Summer and Prince, and they are shires. Summer is the mare, and she is also my biggest, like, horse. And lovely Prince is the stallion. Then, quite far down from them, we have our little Shetland ponies. The smallest one on the end is called Ginger Nut, and I think he's actually a mini Shetland foal, so he's absolutely tiny. Then this dude here is called Patch, and I think he's also a mini Shetland foal. Then we've got Dinky, the lovely mare. I absolutely love her. She is so sweet. Then on the end here, we've got Peach, who's looking quite unimpressed about stuff, and he is a gelding. I think they're all looking particularly small because I've got them next to the two biggest horses, so that's quite funny. <laughs> Then, continuing on, we've got our two Camarages. So this is Monty and Bandit, and they are two stallions. Then over here on his own, we have Fudge, and he is a Dartmoor pony stallion. And then we've got a little trio of Appaloosas here. We've got Autumn the mare, Rocky the stallion, and Pixie the yearling. Then finally on the end, we have Ace, who is a halfling of stallion, and Blondie, who is a halfling of foal. And yes, that is it for that row. Let me come back up here. 
And we can start off with my Arabians. This lovely Palmino mare here is called Mystery. The fall in between the two of them is Brownie. And finally, we've got Wildfire, who is a stallion. And finally, right here on the end are the last pair. They are my two American saddlebreds. The gelding here is called Seamus, and the mare is called Whirlwind. Okie kokie, so those are all of my shalike horses. Now over here I've got some horses that are a different brand, but I use them with my barn anyway. On the end here are my two collector horses. This big guy is Titan, and he is a Clydesdale stallion. And this big mare here is Pegasus, and she is a Mustang. Then the next three horses here are all Papo horses. The first horse here is Cowgirl, and she is a mare. Then we've got her little foal, or actually maybe a yearling, because he's quite big. Anyway, his name's Carlos. And the final Papo horse on the end here is a yearling, and her name is Midnight. I've had this little horse for absolutely ages, and I think at some point I actually tried to customise it, except I used a black sharpie, <laughs> which was an absolutely terrible idea, so now it's sort of black and shiny. <laughs> So yes, I definitely really need to fix this horse because she's been like this for ages now. I'm just going to pop her back over here because she's really not looking her best. <laughs> and finally, the last two I've got over here, I don't actually know what brand either of them are. The first stallion here is called Churro and he's an Andalusian. I think he was made to look like the Shalike Tennessee Walker gelding. But he's definitely not, he's just a copy. You can even see the seam where he's joined together around his shoulder there. But I love him all the same, I think he's awesome, so we're gonna pop him back over there. And now this last little horse here is called Charlie. This guy actually used to be called Sunshine, and he was bright yellow, but I repainted him so he's a nice liver chestnut now. So yeah, that's Charlie. Let me pop him back down there with his friend Churro. All right, those are all of my horses, but I've also brought down all of my animals here because I really feel like they deserve just as much love. So yeah, the first one here is my lovely reindeer dancer. Then we've got the donkeys, Betty, Mickey and Minnie. We have some extremely cute fluffy rabbits down here. We've got Mango, the big orange one here, and little Snowball right next to her. Then we have all of the little cats here. The first one is OJ, then we've got Lynx, Sergeant Tibbs, and the absolutely tiny kitten, Oreo Jr, or just Oreo for short. Moving on down, we have the two goats. The one on the left is called Coco, and the one on the right is Hot Chocolate, but Chocky for short. Then we've got the two little pink pigs, so we've got Pepper and Pinky. Then we've got Clancy, this huge Papo Goose. Then next to him we have our little dogs. The little white one here is Popcorn or Pop, a little Chihuahua puppy. Then we've got the two miniature schnauzers, Chip and Roxy. Here in second to last we have Ted, and I'm guessing he's a little terrier, but he is very cute. And finally we've got Mrs McGregor, and she is a pug. And slightly randomly on the end of the row we have my two zebras. The little foal here is called Scooby, and he is absolutely adorable. Look at those ears, I mean, oh my goodness. And then his mum here is called Daphne. So yes, those are the farm animals. Now over here is a little bonus. I've included all of my other little wild animals. I absolutely love any type of animals, so I definitely couldn't leave any of these guys out. I'm going to start over here on the right with some of the underwater animals. So we've got this huge blue whale here. A lovely bottlenose dolphin. And finally here we have our blue shark, which I absolutely love. Coming over here to the left, we've got our little baby gibbon. I think I actually named this one Marshmallow because it's really, really cute. <laughs> Behind it, very randomly, we've got the big polar bear here. And then over here, we've got my two leopards who are just so pretty. Then we've got two tigers. We've got a black panther up here in front. We've also got two jaguars, some cheetahs, and a fairly big pride of lions here. You may have noticed by now that I absolutely love big cats. <laughs> Over here are my three wolves, then we've got two very cute seals, and a tiny little arctic fox, and then right on the end here we've got the special lion for Shalike's 85th birthday. He is totally rocking the glitter in his mane. Oh my gosh. Okay, and over here my two very last things. We have this absolutely magnificent ice griffin, and this very cool snow wolf right here, and I absolutely love how awesome they look together. Yeah, it's really cool. Okay, so that is it for my 2021 New Year's collection tour. I really hope you enjoyed it. I always think collection tours are great if you need some name inspiration. Let me know down below which horse or animal is your favourite. Happy 2021. And I'll see you all in my next video. Bye!